this is Bea and hello again. So last week I posted a video about my room here in PGPR and also showing the bathroom, the kitchen and stuff. So I decided that this week I would show you a little bit more and I'm probably gonna do many videos about PGPR just in general but I wanted to start by showing a few of the amenities like laundry room, um, printing stations, like where to fill your bottle and also just like a general overview of like when you first come into PGPR what you see and where the bus stops are at so yeah let's get started okay so this is the main entrance of PGPR and it basically looks like this here is the road so here is where all the taxis take you or if you're a taxi comes here and also here stops the bus A2 and it's the last stop for bus D2 and K and then if you go down further down that road then you get to the um, to the other stop which will be PGP and it's where you take the bus D2 the A1 the K and the BTC and you can either walk just down here or you can go inside I will show you and it looks like this and it's always very loud in here but yeah this is the entrance oh and also there where the man is cleaning uh, there are some packages because when you order something from like Amazon or something to eat or anything they will be delivered there and then you can just pick them up and some packages are there for days but nobody takes them or anything so yeah this is the entrance so let's go down then that is the security desk where you basically have to show your mobile key or sometimes you have to log in with the trace together but yeah And if you go to the right, there's this little passage that if you just go there, you end up also at the bus stop. Okay, so once you pass the security desk, there over there is the management office. So you go there if you have any kind of problem and at the end to sign up and everything. And then this is the first, the general area of PGPR is the first thing you see. There's some fountains, but over there there are some picnic tables, but I will show that in more detail another day. So for the bus stop, you come from here and then you just walk and this is how it looks like so yeah there you can take basically all the buses that come through PGPR and during the week they are quite often but I will talk more about the buses another day Okay, then laundry rooms. There is a laundry room in each uh, residence. A residence is made of like five blocks or something like that. And to wash and dry each thing is $1, uh, so it's not bad. And it's basically, at least in my residence, it's in, in the basement, so you can just go down to B1 and then walk because I don't know if I have ever mentioned it but to go out to the street you just have to go to level 1 so yeah this is in in the basement so this is it it's always very loud in here but hopefully you can hear me well so in this case over here you have all the washers and some of them they work with this thing and you have to pay with your needs card which you can get also for the tra public transport and others you need to pay with coins 
um, by the main office at the main entrance there is um, a coin changer like you put a bill and it gives you coins and then over here are the dryers and same thing some work with the coins some work with the with the needs card but today it's actually broken so it's a bit complicated and then you can decide to dry your clothes here but it takes a while i'd say because it's very humid so i think the dryer is the best option and this is how a water fountain looks like it's there all over the place mostly in like floor once of in the first floor of every block i think so and you have three tabs one for cold water one for hot water and one for like normal water but yeah it's it's good so this is the entrance to the printing station and right in front of it is residence three and if you up, go up these stairs and then to the left and then for, further down you get to again to the other um bus stop which is the pqb house and finally for printing i think there are more than one printing stations at pupr but i always come to this one because it's easy and i know it and this one is in residence four in block 15 just in level one so you're just walking and it looks like this so there is uh, like a laptop and then two printers here and you have all the instructions written in the machine so it's just following them but basically how it works you have to get a card like this cardiflex which costs two dollars and then you top it up and just put this here so it changes the card value for whatever you have and then in this cable here you can connect your usb so it's important that to print here you need a usb and then you just open it and print it normally and we'll print either here or in the other and basically each page i it costs three cents yeah it says right here it's three cents so i don't know i think it's nice to have it i believe there are other printers that you don't need to have a usb to print but i don't exactly know where they are or how they work i know in i have also printed in utown without needing a usb but here i just come here and for example there's another fountain uh, so yeah there are different styles but there are quite a lot so this is basically the end of the video. I know I only showed a few things, but it's just there are so many things in PGPR that it's impossible to cover everything. So that's why I will try to make different videos. And yeah, I hope this video was useful and that you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and follow me on Instagram. I hope you have a great day.